Hey guys, how are you doing? It's a little bright and I'm trying to use the sun as a backdrop, but <laughs> we'll see. Um, yeah, I hope you're doing well. What am I up to? I'm starting to lose my voice. Um, <laughs> it's so funny because this is a cruise with so much partying, but I'm just hanging out with my friends in their, you know, rooms, catching up, getting food, eating, like a family dinner together. <laughs> I love that and it's been really uplifting me and I'm enjoying it so much. Um, yeah, so a lot of the stuff I've been processing over the past few days and I went to go watch a show yesterday. Um, and long story short, the show was so amazing with this one singer who she just put it out there and for some reason I just I just started bawling in the middle of the show and uh, I just I was just connecting with so with it so much and I I just let it out bawled cried and I felt so good. And, uh, well, everyone in the audience, there's a handful of people who were crying as well. It was so good. <laughs> and, um, you know, I just also sat in it and I wanna make a video on some loving kindness meditations, but, you know, whenever I'm feeling a certain way with certain people, I, I just sit in and I realize that it's all on me, you know. I have full control over what I feel and the stuff that I'm letting fester is something that I am putting my attention into. And so a loving kindness meditation is really to shift my focus onto something different, less on anxiety, less on trying to expect things a certain way and more to unconditional love and with more unconditional love I just feel so much better and you know regardless of what people do it's just so much love to be had and you know, it's not complete, you know, nonsense. It's not trying to believe something that I'm not believing, but I could feel when I'm like talking about this, there's still a lot of stuff being processed, but I can definitely tell I'm still working through it. And I think the more I practice unconditional love, I will feel so much better, and that's what I need to do. <laughs> um, but yeah, so the cruise is going good. I am out and about, and getting sunburned. You can't see it because the sun's so bright, but it's so much fun. Um, I didn't realize the cruise is going to be so much fun. <laughs> um, it is so relaxing, and I'm not going crazy, crazy. I'm just doing things at my own pace, sometimes at a snail's pace. <laughs> um, but let me show you the view this time. So we are docked in Cozumel, Mexico. And when they dock, they dock with all of these boats and all these other cruise ships and I really don't like it, but all of the kids and families come on, and it's like a... <laughs> Can you imagine thousands of people all getting off at the boat at the same time, trying to do the same things? It is crazy. <laughs> uh, talk about solo traveling. This is a, <laughs> it's like a, conven it's like a traveling convention going from port to port. <laughs> <laughs> and Dreamforce in San Francisco is bad enough. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, so, 
feeling so much better today. And got lots of food in, rested, and yeah. Taking some time today to edit my video, edit my newsletter, and if you don't have my newsletter yet, subscribe. I'm gonna put the comment below. And yeah, it's oh, I just love doing it and just trying new different things. I'm just my creativity, my creative juices are just flowing and I feel so great. <laughs> but yeah. And I hope everyone is having a great week. And the lesson today is really just practicing unconditional kindness and giving everyone, everyone around you that because everyone deserves it. And so do you. <laughs> and with that, I'll talk to you later. <laughs> Bye.